Hi, welcome to Drone for Edu Challenge for Industrial Revolution, the quantum leap for STEM talent pool in Malaysia. We are on the brink of a fourth industrial revolution and Malaysia must increase participation in science, technology, engineering and mathematics subjects to meet the demands of its evolving job market. Our current education system isn't converting enough students into modern, high-level professions such as nanotechnology, bioengineering, computer science, yet these are areas of superior growth. Technological innovation and disruptors are emerging at an unprecedented speed obsoleting many of the roles we know today and creating a sharp increase in demand for the digitally competent. The academics at University Technology Malaysia realised the need to integrate the core curricular activities with the knowledge in the fourth industrial revolution, regardless of the limitation during pandemics. Today and worlds are now highly relying on the Internet of Things, cloud computing, autonomous system and fourth industrial technology. Hence, educators have to step up to unleash student potential in the respective field. The teaching and learning horizon are started to change with the fourth industrial wave. Education is the key to revolutionize the economy and society. The emergence of COVID-19 has shifted the paradigm of teaching curriculum and urged the educators to venture into the technical approach to create meaningful learning experience during home-based learning. Through Hitagagi approach applied in the drawn for edu challenge, it allows the students to decide the learning focus that drives them to engage, explore and act towards knowledge. By using challenge-based learning, it boosts the motivation of the students to equip themselves with the needed knowledge available in the drawn for edu challenge. In the age of knowledge and skill emancipation, students need to evolve from passive recipients to analysts and synthesizers. It is a revolution in which teachers can no longer claim themselves as the sole experts to assess information. The students now are at the centre of the learning process rather than the teacher or the curriculum. It encourages flexibility, forge new paths, new questions and new contexts. The student's self-determined will lead transformational experience. This benefits individual learners and ultimately society. There are seven elements of HITAGIGI which are approval, facilitators, choice, agreement, review, assessment and feedback. They are incorporated in the design of Drawn for Edu Challenge, the incorporation of synergy and innovation model of government, university, community, industry, successfully revitalized STEM education through incorporation of online webinars, quizzes, programming tasks, assessment, mentoring and interview designed in competition mode. The project objective of Tron for Edu Challenge is to introduce drone technology to school students in Malaysia, raise awareness of the use of drone technology to school students and associate drone technology with STEM education at schools, and to build programming skills among school students in Malaysia. To date, we have about 2,430 students registered, and this year we have uh, innovate and also improve in which we will in, uh, incorporate the team Based learning among them. Uh, for team drone, we have about 1,215 team of drone from 536 schools all over Malaysia with the support of the KPM, Iskandar Investment, as well as all our collaborators. And this year is very special because we also include uh, the special education for primary schools and also secondary school based on the demands from the uh, school and the students because uh, last year we only do for the secondary schools but this year we have improvised in which to meet the demand from the schools. Uh, continuing uh, to that, our challenge-based learning focus uh, from uh, for the edu drone edu challenge, focus on engagement, investigating and acting towards challenge. Uh, it explore and boost the student motivation by the students despite the virtual modes apply in this uh, drone for edu challenge. And this year we also have our very own in-house uh, drone for edu challenge system where we uh, make sure that everyone, every student can, uh, can join the system, understand. We even uh, do our very own uh, YouTube uh, video to to inform the student on how to use this uh, dc4 ir system uh, the dc4 ir module also emphasized on the challenge based learning approach consists of learning module assessment engagement with the industry and mentoring with the dc4 finalists that were rejuvenated into the in-house system developed by university technology malaysia in this module the design was also to empower students and teachers in creating more champions in drone technology the module of the 4 
comprises a uh, programming components of drone, force industrial revolution, internet of things, future of STEM, and other related drone educational materials. This module being reviewed by the educational and content experts to ensure that the content is relevant and up to date. The module of DC4 IR is aligned with the new innovation in teaching and learning NALI model in creating entrepreneurial academia by blending the pedagogy and digital learning material. The DC4 IR module also believe in the motto of never leave anyone behind. Hence, uh, in 2021, DC4 module were also designed to meet the special education student. The category of DC4 IR competition were also tailored to ensure that everyone from primary and secondary students involved in this project. And from the dynamic assessment of uh, we, we designed, uh, the DC4 finalists had given significant impact to the panel of jury due to the creativity in designing their drone. Among the feedback by the juries are uh, in terms of gender equality, where women and uh, men both are empowered to learn about drone. The juries also highlight that the students' ability to track the problem and propose a suitable solution using drone in the agriculture, safety, medicine, and other respective field are very impressive. The juries believe that DC4 for IR successfully become the quantum leap in creating and building more STEM talent pool in Malaysia. Among the feedback collected from the students, they really want drone education to be embedded in the school curriculum. And the launching of DC4 IR is also uh, blessed by our Datin Sri Hajah Nur Zamani binti uh, Abdul Hamid, together along with our VC Vice Chancellor Professor Dato. Uh, P.S. Ahmad Fauzi bin Ismail, also Dato I.R. Khairil Anwar, Puan Mazna, and also Tuan Haji Shahilun for JPNG, as well as our director of the program, Dr. J. Suman Puspanathan, in which in the launching we also have uh, published our very own program book as well as the YouTube uh, video launching. Uh, the novelty of this uh, DC4 IR is also not limited to the learning and teaching of, for the students in the competition. Uh, value added to the design curriculum of uh, DC4 IR is the establishment of NALI among the UTM experts in which we produce our own digital materials uh, through an in-house system. Uh, okay. uh, and also um, to, uh, to also produce a drone intelligence programming, STEM education and fourth industrial revolution. Um, webinars and also modules okay uh, this also highlight that uh, the novelty of drone for edit challenge is this is the first drone challenge based learning in the world that incorporates webinar quizzes programming tasks mentoring design in competition mode and also uh, it is able to reduce the inequalities and expand the opportunities for special students and also establish the quadrupedic and synergy between government, industry and NGO committee. The DC4 IR module also induced creative problem solving among the students as mentioned by all the panel of juries and this is successfully become the quantum leap for STEM talent pool. The interview conducted with DC4 IR finalists also have shown that the students are very proud to be the participant of this competition as it allowed them to explore the future of their careers. Despite the competition will run as, uh, you know, in competition, uh, but, you know, uh, the family, uh, the teachers are all very supportive and they are actually a big part of the learning and engaging promotes peer learning. So the innovation that we uh, improve uh, for our drone for any challenge in 2021 is we create a supportive uh, ecosystem through the involvement of our expert from industry drone player and finalists uh, 2020 as uh, the mentor for this year finalists and the model design wa was uh, actually underwent a very thorough review process to really benefit the audience and then the integration of STEM model with quiz in incorporated in our in-house in -house, uh, DC4 system and the drone design uh, amplify the impact of STEM, STEM learning experience. This is the best the achievement that we have uh, for the drone edu challenge. And then this is for, for the media massa. And then this is the impact that uh, we have for our uh, our our drone for edu challenge, which we promote a uh, peer learning drone committee, amplify the STEM learning experience, leverage the ICT skills, uh, produce creative and complex problem solver as, as well as uh, this uh, follows uh, the, the those uh, effective implementation and uh, this is all the committee that made sure that this project is a success so despite the covid pandemic the innovation in dc4 ir has successfully become the quantum leap for the stem talent pool among primary secondary school students via hitting approach thank you